Okay guys, so you've seen me do a lot of editing on the site and um, I haven't really spoken to you about publishing. So um, how you publish is pretty easy. I'm gonna show you what uh, happens. So say if we have this bit of text here and I'm gonna put in some other text, award-winning photographer, uh, she stinks. Sorry, whoever you are, Janelle. So. I put in the text here, she stinks. I have to wait until my client approves it um, before I can um, actually put that live. So what I can do is I can put in stuff and not let it go live easily by clicking on done and then save draft. And what, that hap what happens is it will save it. As you can see, it's no longer on the site. This is the live site, but when I click back on the page builder, you could see it pops straight back up again. Now there is another instance where you can discard. So I can put in, not really, I could save that. And I could press done and I could just discard it. Okay, now when we go back into the page builder, you are not gonna see any of the edits that I've done. So you have to be super careful in terms of um, how you use uh, the publish. And um, if you decide that, you know, you've actually just made a mistake on the site, then you're better off just either refreshing rather than publishing or refreshing rather than clicking on discard. Okay, another thing you could do as well is if you click on the page builder, there is a way that you can look back at the different versions of the site that you've done. So if I click here on easy, you will see here we've got a list of revisions and it's got all the times here. So I can click back to, I mean, it's not really gonna make that much of a difference because I have hardly done anything on here. Uh, let's have a look, but you could see we've got different time spans. Okay, so that is like a very obvious time span. Um, but uh, yeah, you can go back and forth of different versions that you have possibly done. Clearly, it doesn't save every single edit that you have done, um, but there is an option there in case you do cock up and you need to go back to it. Um, and that's it for this tutorial. See you in the next.